morning. Well, actually, technically good afternoon. It is 3 p.m. I'm headed over to my friend Britton's house, and we're going to be going down to West Valley to the same place where I got my exhaust. I'm going to be getting a new part for the Subi, and I thought I'd make a video about it. Here's the hint. We have made it. That is called, that's a company called Striker. This is a company I do not know what the name is, but Rally Sport is on this building all the way down on the very far, if you're looking at it left side, but to us, the right side. We're gonna go and grab the shift knobs, come out, do an unboxing, and then when I get back, I'll install it on my car. He's going to install one on his car as well. He has a 2003 WRX, I have a 2006, and this is a really very basic video, but I just wanted to make it so I can like document me getting a shift knob. Okay, Britton is gonna open his first. I have mine right here, but we're actually in his car right now, so he's gonna open his and then install his first. I'm gonna take this one first. Is it floppy yet? No, it's floppy. How do I do it? Like oh. that. Bubble wrap. Okay. <laughs> nice light bulb, bro. <laughs> $70 for this freaking light bulb, man. That's dope. So we just made it back. I have my shift knob right here. We have my car right here. Let's hop on inside and just quickly put it on and then basically I'll tell you how it feels, how everything is about it. Right. Welcome to my 2006 Hon Welcome to my 2006 Subaru WRX. This is a $70 plastic ball that I'm going to be replacing with this leather ball. Step one, twist off the old ball. Once you have it like this, just simply, maybe not simply, but pull it out of its old leather, if you want to call it leather. Uh, this is actually way heavy, dude. What the heck, bro? That's so weird. Mine is way lighter than this. Then you want to go ahead after that and get a key or something to open up the box. All right, here's the unboxing of the Cobb shift knob. The first thing we have is two Cobb stickers and the ball, or the knob, whatever you want to call it. We only need this for the stickers now, so we'll put that down there. Here's the actual packaging itself. It is in bubble wrap, so you know you can have a little fun with it before you have more fun with it on the road or the track. Uh, let's just pop this bad girl boy open. And we have the knob. So it is lighter than the stock shift knob itself. Like it's actually, I'd probably say maybe like a third of the weight. Actually, no. It's like if this weighed, like, <laughs> I don't know how to wear this. If this weighed five pounds, this I'm not weighs recording. Three pounds. For real? Sorry. It's <laughs> filming that all over again. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Wait, you're filming. Oh my, you're so dumb. So the stock shift knob is a little bit heavier than this one. If you're looking for a weighted shift knob, this one is not weighted, especially compared to this. This is actually pretty freaking heavy. Uh, but it is good feeling. It's better looking in my opinion too. So let's just go ahead and install it now. This is probably the easiest installation that you could probably do on a car, like easiest mod, is you literally just push this in like that. And then just start screwing on the ball. like. Once you do that, like that is literally the install process of the shift knob. And once you have done that, that is now your new shift ball, shift knob, whatever you want to call it. So the color I got is white with the red base. Um, so yeah, for my 2006 WRX, this was my second mod. My first one was the exhaust. This is the ball. Uh, my friend Britton, he actually has been driving since Salt Lake home with it. So I'm going to let him tell you how he thinks everything feels about it. But my personal opinion, uh, is that it feels super good in quality and the material feels like it's not gonna get hot So when it's sitting in the Sun, it's not gonna burn your hand and the feel of it just feels like actually so good I'm not just saying that like It feels very good now to Britain with his thoughts on driving it home from Salt Lake Oh, it's not as heavy the ball is not as heavy as the stock one and so that was a little different just like shifting and stuff <laughs> <laughs> but other than that, it was pretty nice. It's nice and smooth. You can get your hands around it like that, like the old one, whatever it is. 
it's just like you're stuck in this fixed position like I guess you can do that but it's just not as comfortable so it's super ergonomic it's like this teardrop shape um, and yeah it's pretty dope I would recommend getting one it makes your driving experience a lot more pleasurable okay. none of this is an ad for Cobb in any way we both bought these from Rally Sport Direct in Utah and we both installed them today. So that is going to wrap up this short little video. Uh, I know it wasn't necessarily the most cool mod to your car, but definitely if you guys could feel this shift knob and actually use it, I really wish you could. It is so good feeling and I definitely, I haven't even driven it yet, but I think it's worth it. So that's going to wrap up this video. I hope you guys did enjoy. I will see you in the next one. Peace out.